Ah, I didn't see you there. My name is Dirk Dalvington. And I'm here to talk to you about Lyme disease. Contrary to the most popular belief, Lyme disease is not caused by a Lyme, but rather a ferocious blood sucking deer tick. There are two stages of Lyme disease early and late. If you have early, you might feel pain, swelling in your joints, fever, and headache. And but late, we develop chronic arthritis and other bad things. Lyme disease is found in the United States, mostly in the northeast part of it, which means it's found in Pennsylvania and in your county. It is also found at my house. Mr. I think I have Lyme disease. How do I know? Let's say that you were walking through the woods and a tick jumped on you. You probably didn't even know and carried on your way. Well, what are your symptoms, lad? I have sore joints, a fever, and this rash. Hmm. Sounds like you have Lyme disease. A good way to prevent Lyme disease is by wearing bright, long sleeve shirts and bright, long pants. You might also want to wear bug spray. Make sure it has deep meat. That gets rid of the ticks and kills it. I'm sitting here right now with a man who had the dreaded disease of the Lyme. And I'm here to ask him a few questions. It's a good day to have you with us. So, what was the worst part about having Lyme disease? Thank you, Derek. Um, but I had Lyme disease. And a, lot of, a lot of long nights. Uh, Sometimes I couldn't even get out of bed. Until we got up, I got rid of the lightheaded and go back down again. It really just wasn't fun. How long did you have it for? Um, I had Lyme disease for about three months. Um, I had to take antibiotics every day. Three times a day, I think it was. Um, but it was alright, because it tasted like local gum. And how did your life change? Lyme disease rocked my world. Thank you. Thank you very much for this. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Lyme disease. Quite alive. Quite disease. 100% deadly. Unless you're part of the 99% of that survived. I'm Derek Darlington. Good night.